It's October 31st. I am a year older. There is one question, though. What fucking year is it? Welcome back to... Something, I guess? I'm not very sure, but... This... Is Wrath of the Lamb Eternal Edition! You ever expect me to come back to this? After how many years? No idea? No, no idea, really. It's just very strange, you see. So, hello, again. This is Joker Crazy, by the way. If you didn't already figure it out. This is the Halloween special I decided on. I'm recording this the 14th of October because I had no ideas. And I had this idea, but I never got around to it because, well, it's no secret that this entire year has been kind of sparse in content. Thanks to wanting to settle on making drawings all over the place. And, you know, I'm fine with doing that. Don't want to think the man is going, ah! I heard that from my headphones because I moved my arm. I wanted to just move my <laughs> glasses up. Yeah, like, uh, the drawing stuff I want to keep doing. I'm very close to the end now, so very much P pushing through. And then after this year is done, hopefully, I can just put my head to the grindstone and just edit a bunch of videos and get going. Which, you know, that's all you really want in life, isn't it? Just to do whatever and watch videos that I make. And I'll just open up once I actually have nothing to oblige myself to do for the year. But to talk about the game very briefly, this here is, you know, Eternal Edition. We're doing the hard mode because this was very much not in the game when I last played it. How many years ago now? I have no idea. And in Eternal Edition, there's Eternal Champions and a bunch of other miscellaneous details that have changed. So it's definitely going to be a little bit of a different experience. And it's going to be interesting to get through because, wow, wow pin. I mean, I've seen some of these because I've been playing this in my off time. But, you know, there's still a bunch of achievements I've yet to get, and that goes my eternal heart. Though, since this is an eternal boss, it should, hopefully, on the kill, thank you, Pin, for dropping one of them. Also the box. Yeah, I'll take that trinket. I'll have to toss it later on, but I'll take it for now. The tower! Whatever, you know. We'll just have it run. So this brings back memories to you, then thank you very much. I guess I'm doing my work. It just is very strange to have come back to this after multiple years of repentance. <laughs> Which, you know, as I... I don't know if I'm going to release them by before this video comes out or not, but... I, oh, yeah, right. I mention in the challenge videos that were of repentance that, you know, as of editing, or as of recording this video, they're not fully edited yet, but some of them have been done the full edit. About ready to be exported, at least. But I mentioned that, hey, I've been doing, I've 100 percented the Repentance on Switch, which you've probably seen on Twitter as well. And also, I started doing it again, because I really wanted to do it a second time because I have no control over my abilities. <laughs> but you know, it's just something I wanted to do. Just spend some time doing it instead of, I don't know, playing Xenoblade, finishing that. Playing Mario Rabbit Fox of Hope, finishing that. Doing other things too, finishing that off. I have other games I've been playing as well on the side too. Like, I've been playing Dave the Diver a whole bunch. Because after that Nintendo Direct, there was a whole demo that was released and I played the demo I was just like, Wait a minute, this fucks! I want to buy it! And so I bought it on the Steam Deck and have been playing that since. It's been a treasure, trust me. Tough love, nice. So back to the matter at hand. Uh, yeah, a bunch of the stuff that's still remaining on here is just, you know, a lot of achievements. Because you have to beat the games all the characters, have to beat all the different paths as well. I'm sure it's going to be easier to take them to Satan, possibly, I'm not sure. As opposed to going all the way down to chest each time. Because there's still an achievement for beating chest, which I've yet to do. 
I mean, I've, I've seen the fan of boost. I've seen Blue Baby as this Eternal Edition, and it is a something. But at that time, all I had on me <laughs> was the dead cat. So it was just a very perilous kind of pushing against the brick wall, which didn't end up succeeding. So I just have to end up eventually doing that. Which, who knows, maybe I will be able to uh, Magic 8 Ball, Shot Speed Up, and the Hanged Man. Any boss, Devil Deal. The Nail? Nail gives me health. So I'm gonna take the Nail. Yeah, and it's a full health. Crazy. Gotta get used to all that classic Flash Isaac stuff. Want some more, Ray? Oh, I'm amp the music, though. Oh, somehow I got a compass. Not sure. Uh, unless that's always been the case, where it shows you where the boss room is. I don't think it is. No, that's Magic Eight Ball doing it. I think. Yeah. Again, I'm I'm worrying my knowledge from rebirth slash repentance over to the Flash Isaac, which doesn't always coalesce or just merge together. I guess is the word I was looking for there. Oh God, these fucking. Eternal Globins are very and very annoying. Because they fire off their stuff, and you still have to murder them like that. So they have to just reform themselves. <laughs> it's very dumb. Ah, oh, there we go. I guess I have the Hangman if I need it. What's in here? Bro, stop giving me active items, please. Bruh. Unless you remember what that looks like. <laughs> now you don't need to remember anything. That's not how this works, Jim Shure. I'll just proceed forward on my quest. There's like a six room charge to this thing, so it's like Book of Revelations, but lesser. But it also does increase damage, I believe. That's the thing with this version, though. You don't have the found HUD. I cry. Ah. Many things you don't have. You, you can't, like, blow up. Shopkeepers for increased devil real chance. Can't see what's going on. At least all the rooms are gonna be compact, so they all stay within this window. But there are just other things that aren't a factor anymore. <laughs> Which is. It's funny. Can't wait for Brimstone to show up and fix my problems. It might. It might not. It could be a little bit of both. Come on, you, there we go. And there's the nail. I think I'm gonna save it. Alright, oh, I remember these guys. The charges that evolve into the sacks, and if they stay awake long enough, they become like eternal booters. Very weird. Fistula. Oh no, it's eternal fistula. I, I don't even think I know this. Okay, so this still does have the stompy effect. So I'm still able to do that. All right, the full health bar is like this, and this is oh my man, oh this sucks. That sucks a fat one, dude. Oh goodness gracious me, <laughs> Lord. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's some bosses in this I still haven't seen their eternal versions of. I think Eternal Gertie sucks. I remember that. Because he just has a, a massive wave of shots to fire out, and you have to actually be aware that that's going to happen. It's very annoying. If he does show up on this floor, then you'll know. And you'll see. Oh, jeez, he's following me! He was destroyed. Very swiftly. I'm definitely going to put priority on just editing this one quickly together. In comparison. Because, yeah, I mean... Why else wouldn't that be done? That's just the way it's gonna be done. I I don't have a bit. It's like I said earlier, I don't have anything major planned for the Halloween special this year, and I've been keeping the tradition going for many years at this point. I think it's 2012, so like it's been it has it has been 10 years of this, and that's just gonna be what we do here. Can you please destroy yourself? Be like- there we go. Okay, those guys don't count. 
I want these guys to... It's definitely funny going back, looking at all this. Just being like, oh man, that's how they used to look. They look weird. In comparison to the Repentance look. Oh, jeez. The, the, yeah, oh, Jesus. I think I remember. Yeah, they take other things instead of just coins. I've seen them take keys away from me. Those eternal greed heads. Very rude of them. Oh, good. That's exactly what I was looking for. But who's gonna stay in my path? Damn it. I thought that was gonna work. Well, that guy. Yeah, because he's, uh. Ah! Oh well, there goes my limited chances of the devil room. Which will probably go up once I use Nail in the boss fight. Ah, why'd you do that? We don't know. <laughs> also, the funny thing about this play in Eternal Edition, you don't have to worry about time limits. There's no boss rush or a hush to go to, thankfully. It's just you play for as long as you can, but you just can't quit out in the middle of a run. This, oh, it's forever alone. Not this enamoration. This enamoration definitely is better. But also, you can see, like, the very small hitbox that that thing has already. It might even just be the same size. I'm not even very sure. It could be. Oh, I wonder if it's gonna be cursed. Let's see if it's cursed. Do we have the cursed secret room? We do not. I have had it when I've been playing this recently, where it spawned the secret room adjacent to the boss room. I forgot that it used to work like that. Carrion Queen, oh you bastard. Oh, I don't know. Bastard would still work for a queen, wouldn't it? I think, maybe? It's just like Bastard's son is just, you don't know. The parent. No idea. Hi! I'm very rude. I want you to leave me alone. I mean, Maggie doesn't have the, the speed to begin with, so that's an issue with that. Hey! At least the pattern is uh, abatable, easy to discern. Ah! Oh. Ah! Never mind! All stem cells and some health. Alright, nothing. I can't press the map button to toggle open the map. I just did that because I didn't realize what I was doing. Yeah, if you couldn't already tell by now, this is the Steam Deck. Because that's where it's best to go. And someone made a nice action set which made it so that you can swap between mouse control and button control because you still have to use the mouse for the menus. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, it definitely works exactly as you would expect on the Steam Deck. So, you could still play your classic Isaac, vintage Isaac shenanigans. If you so desire. I wouldn't recommend it. Just play Repentance instead. It's a lot <laughs> Oh! No, wait! I just realized. Uh, because it's the hard mode. That challenge room is in the normal challenge room. I just looked at the map to see that. So I'm gonna go back there in a second, once I survive this room. Chances are I'm not going to. Though we can be optimistic. Wait. Buddy. Wanna try it again? Wait. And then they separate. I guess I gotta fly if it's protection. And there's the bomb. Oh, right. I forgot that it does that. It's very rude. Even though it already happened already. Eternal Challenge Room! Scapular! Featuring Eternal War! Oh my lord! Oh, you fucking suck! Actively! Jesus! Uh, I despise you. Oh, I'm just gonna keep making more! Now nah, this is gonna stink. And Scapula's good. Just gotta deal with it. Especially if you're doing this. Ass hat. Hey. Let's circle around the room. Doing them so. Oh, he even spawns them on that path, too. 
Come on, circle strats! And I think the worst part is that there's gonna be another fight after this. Pepper alone! Get him! That still wasn't enough! Eee! Hey, there we go. But what are you gonna do? If anything, nothing good. A bunch of V's. Ugh! Oh wait, I was gonna say limit my path, but I have hang. Ooh, chunky frame rate. We love chunky frame rate. Exactly why you went there. And that's exactly why you didn't pick up the eternal heart. Because you know better. Don't you, Joshua? <laughs> oh Jesus. Look at how chunky and slow this is. Embarrassing. I roast the shit out of Binding of Isaac Eternal Edition, Wrath of the Lamb even. Because it's it's just not as good as the version that we have now in Re Rebirth. But it's like, hey, I can't fault that I was playing this before Rebirth came out. And I did those like nine videos on it. So it's, hey, hey, very nice. So yeah, like I can't fault that this game was influential and I brought stuff back. But playing it now, man, is it clunky as shit. Oh, mom's contact. Freeze effect. Freezer, freezer. Well, we have that. It just takes a little bit longer to get to the actual boss fight. She's still all the way over here, you see. Now I use the nail to fail. Why'd you even stand still, Joshua? Oh, that was a freeze effect. Look at how fast you are moving! And that guy didn't even get frozen up. And now they're desynced! Horrid. Lord have mercy. I can go here. Yeah, there we go. I don't have the flight to even look at that. Oh, fish it is. Can't wait for Eternal Mom to show up. She is a wonderful human being. There goes my eternal heart. Shouldn't have picked it up soon. But it's it doesn't matter, does it? Come on, you. Wait. Man, why am I still wearing a dressing gown? It's hot in this room. It's hot in this October month. Very hot, very warm. Very, very. Oh, the boomfly. The boomflies look so weird. It's true, really. But this also brings me back like to the memories of when Rebirth was being teased. And they had those four teasers of what the art style would look like for Rebirth. And the winner was eventually like the one that looked closest to vanilla. And that's the one we got. But then there's like another one, which it's like a Game Boy one that took place in the caves, and that looked pretty good to me. And you know, it's like a it's yeah, it's a missed opportunity, but I can't fault that what we have already looks fine enough. So yeah, that's that that was my story. Like comments and subscribe. You have you guys like hearing stories? I can tell some wonderful stories, truly. Ah, Jesus. Heaven forbid. I'm also wondering what I'm gonna do with the video. <laughs> like, it's tempting to just be like, oh, I'm gonna edit it very quickly and then have it set as a premiere so it just stays there as like a premiere for like a month? Half a month? It'd be funny, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that. <laughs> it would be, wouldn't it? Alright, the pooter. Oh, you just being a dickhead. I'm gonna put that there. It's not gonna blow it up properly. Oh, it did! Good. Uh, so that's gonna send me to the devil room. I, I just have a feeling. So I want you to die first. I was incorrect. Is there even anything very briefly in this shop? Ooh, battery. But I don't have a penny. And it doesn't work like it does in <laughs> Reaver. So. Let's see. Oh, no, pennies here. I have one penny. Just one extra penny. That's the one we needed. 
I've said this before and I'll say it again, like the one thing that is great about re uh, this version, Wrath of the Lamb still, it's that the music is still very good and nostalgic. So yes, Monstro 2, or Eternal Edition. I really don't remember. Oh no, there it is, it's like the gradual charge. So I could keep gaining health, I'm alive in the room for so long. Cool. So you stayed there for quite a while. Stay frozen, I know you jumped. There you are. Ah! Keep her going. Whoa. Just a couple more, and I can use the nail again. Will it keep increasing my damage, though? I have no idea. And it's hard to even tell on this version. It's, like, like, we don't have the found hut. And, like, the stats aren't, like, told. I mean, technically, technically stats aren't told when you're doing it in Rebirth, either. It's only when you have the found hut on, it shows you, like, hey, this is what's actually happening to your stats currently. Oh man, this song. Dun 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 Oh, lucky. But also, holy shit, the lag. Part of me has no idea if this is the Steam Deck just not being able to handle it, or if it's just the Flash really not being able to handle it. I don't even remember from all that time ago. If it even will. Yeah. No, the Halo, nice. All stats up. It's a good thing to have. Now I just gotta figure my way out to get to the boss room. One plus one free. Oh, because of the, the double bomb, right? One plus one free forever. More of you, more eternal bee lickers. He's at the head of the charge as well, so I was not able to do that. All right, what are you? Range down. That's what you need, Magdalene. That's what you need. The only reason I chose Magdalene for this is because I felt like I needed the survivability of the Yum Heart, and yeah, I got rid of Yum Heart very quickly. So I have no idea. Ugh. Well, there's that guy doing it. There's a, there's a distinct chance, a non zero chance, that we'll be seeing Butler's Chub when we get to the womb. It's entirely possible. I appreciate this. None of those are tinted rocks, none of them have even the X on them. Oh god, the eternal things, well, I remember you. Oh, you dickhead, get off of my face! Directly, please. Jesus. This is not very good for me. But it's in slow motion, you can react it's an infinite amount of time. Not quite, that's not how that works, entirely. And the guy just teleported! The mask teleported, he's teleporting to attack me. Eternal Edition is not fair to the player. It, it really isn't. <laughs> Thank you, buddy, for leaving. And that's all of you again. They just really like giving me these. And limiting my movement opportunities. Did you see all that? All of that? You, did you witness that with your own two eyes? All that plenty of area I can walk around. It's ridiculous, isn't it? Go along, oh, buddy. Buddy, please. Also, I didn't mention it at the time, but in case you forgot, back here, back in Eternal Edition, slash Wrath of the Lamb, slash Vanilla, when you bomb open a secret room, a doorway closes itself. So you want to bomb open that door every time you want to enter it. That's the thing to keep in mind. Which, you know, you may end up forgetting. I would have liked to have stayed in that shop for a little bit to listen to the music. But we gotta get a move on. Just a slight move on. What's the roll recording at even? What, uh, 24 minutes? Okay, that's fine enough. That's, that's average kind of length for an Isaac run, I think. Around this point is when it becomes just very good. 
No, this is just gonna be like average Tainted Lazarus length of a run. Of course it's Eternal Mom. Yay! Why do you see all this? I mean, I don't even remember if she does anything unique. Of course she does. We'll be seeing it eventually. Isaac! She does seem to be stomping down a whole bunch. And I think this is back when that foot attack counts as an explosion. So you could just tank that explosion, I think, if you have explosion proof. Though I don't know if you have explosion proof in this game. Because Host Hat's definitely rebirth. Pyromaniac is definitely rebirth. I have no idea if there even is protection from explosions. <laughs> it's wacky. Eyes. The, the menacing mom instead of the not so menacing mom. And here we go, there's Paleroid. Back when it was just a trinket and not a passive item. Remember that? Of course you don't. It's very, very important information that you just forgot about. Alright. Now we don't have to worry about finding other places. We can just run all the way over to the location designated. Oh, did it hitch for a moment there, the music? I think it hitched for a moment. <laughs> Goodness gracious me. Way! Somehow. With these hollows. Good. Hollow, hollow! <laughs> lordy, lordy. He's almost dead. Come on, you! Now it's just a bunch of explosions to deal with. We're also getting very close to the 12. 12 hearts? Which, you know, back in vanilla, there was no cap. You could just keep getting more and more hearts past the HUD. And it would just let you. That's why they capped it in Rebirth. Which, you know, is a downgrade in sense. But also, are you really going to be needing all of that health? It would just be very invulnerable. You might as well just be careful. I don't know where I'm going with that sentence. It just escaped me for a brief moment in time. Oh, giant boy. Giant spider. I remember <laughs> when I first saw this enemy. I was just playing through it normally, and I said out loud to myself, he's just gonna explode into a bunch of spiders, isn't he? I think I said he's gonna explode into like 12 spiders, and it was just very accurate. Uh, after a while you get used to all the internal edition enemies. Some of them are eternal, others aren't. Oh, it's Eternal Hollow! Who's gonna peek around the corner at me? He's following me! <laughs> ah! Jeez! Really is following me. Why is his face dead? Oh right, because the eternal Larry Juniors, they re refill their own health if you leave them alone long enough. So that's just him with a single head, needing to wait until he gets the stuff restocked, which he didn't. Get in there, buddy. There we go. Now I'm just gonna poke the funny laptop so you see what's actually going on, because it's doing its display thing, it's not fixed. I don't have the money to fix it, it's very, it's a dire situation, but you don't need to know much more about that. It's fine, I think. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just not gonna be worth going into in a video, we don't need to talk about that, let's just focus on the baby game with the baby. He's even more troll box. The Fallen! Oh, it's Utero 1, I didn't even realize. Also, look at this guy, he looks very adorable. Hey, buddy. You might not be in, so rude. Oh, also, because Vanilla, the only reward if Krampus shows up is gonna be the Lump of Coal, which, you know, is pretty decent. Head of Krampus, I found out, was apparently planned for this. So there was just like this pumpkin head item. And it just was not implemented in time. Because it, its function is basically what Head of Krampus became in Rebirth. Which, you know, cool ideas. Cool things line up. 
Yay, more damage. Also her speed. Maggie needs some speed. She really does. <laughs> Laughing at the dick. Why does Maggie have that dream? Is it, what, what are you implying, Isaac? <laughs> I'm kidding. Everyone's always got the same dreams. Because it's all Isaac, clearly. That's what the intent was from the beginning. Oh lordy Lou, I'm at three and a half! That's not very good, it's two and a half now! Oh wait, the homing giant boy! I remember that now. Very unfortunate to remember that at such a time. No extra devil rooms, because I know my luck is terrible. Ouch, my face. More masks, more masks, get a throw me in the corner. At least there's Polaroid to protect me, as well as the scapular. Which the scapula's not gonna do me much good once I take the damage and die here. I just sense it. The Empress! Poor Babylon for free. Very cool. There's the piss effect happening with the half a heart. In Rebirth they made it so it's like strictly half a heart, though back in vanilla it's just like whenever you have half a red heart you're mating. Why did you think that was a good idea, Joshua? That wasn't invulnerability, that was just a damage up and a soul heart. You're not very wise, are you? Get him! He leaped. Leaping lasagna. Ugh! Alright. Is he gonna be here? It was. A bunch of pennies I don't need really because there's no shops at all unless I find like an arcade or just a random guy looking for some moolah time for uh, it lives and I'm gonna use that now because it lives follows you <laughs> it follows you oh my lordy I, I didn't even keep you alive long enough to see that attack fuck that sucks Ew! Disgusting. Let's be enough. It's not gonna be enough time for the nail to charge up again. Though thankfully the freezing effect is gonna keep me going and that's me almost dead. I think I'm going to die eventually. Oh, just give me that for free. You weirdo. Eh. Well, there you go. Today I died. I was killed by this thing in some warm place. I leave all the I own to my cat Guppy. All this cool stuff. Yeah. So that was <laughs> Eternal Edition. It's very goofy. Look at all this stuff. That thing to save. I'm not even sure if it's entirely save because apparently I have the Platinum God and yet some of these items are missing. I'm not very sure. It's just funny to think how very little items there were back here. I want to the return to save. All these challenges. Remember when I did Doctor's Revenge a couple of times? The secret. You probably can do the secret. Maybe that's the secret to actually beating the whole thing. No idea. And all these secrets. You see? Yeah. For some reason I didn't have left hand unlocked on there. I have no idea. There's no way to really check what's going on with the achievements. But I, I've wasted enough of your time, by the way. You've already clicked off the video, whatever the fuck, even. So that was Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lamb. It's a fun little treat for Halloween. If I had anything better for Halloween, then I probably would have had it done in time. But. I ran out of time, thanks to drawing, so I apologize. This is the best I can come up with on such short notice. So, if I ever do this again, just to try and beat Eternal Edition, then I'll, I'll consider it. But for now, it'll just go straight back to regular Rebirth, Repentance, regular, in quotation marks. Yeah, 
So, I will see you in whatever video you watch next. Thank you very much for watching this one. And, yeah, see you then.